Child Fund International exists to help deprived, excluded and vulnerable children to have the capacity to improve their lives and the opportunity to become young adults, parents and leaders who bring a lasting and positive change to their communities. Child Fund places a high value on core outcomes to find a secure and healthy infants, educated confident children and skilled and involved youth. The organisation works in over 30 countries and has worked in Zambia since 1983. In Zambia, most of the people face uh, poverty challenges. In fact, 78% of rural people live in poverty. This situation is compounded by HIV and AIDS with a national prevalence rate of 14.53%. In terms of uh, issues af affecting children, the biggest one is uh, malnutrition, having access to good food, having access to education, having access to health services. And of course, uh, they also struggle with being orphans of AIDS. Child Fund uh, approach is a long-term investment in communities, uh, focusing especially on life stages. In Mumbwa, a rural area outside the Zambian capital Lusaka, Child Fund has worked with the community to give children the best possible start. Parents have been given goats so that they can give milk to their children, as well as potentially earn an income if the goat breeds. Child Fund believes that whatever goes on from early childhood to year five is going to be a platform for the growth of a child. Therefore, Child Fund works with communities, mobilize community members, especially parents, to take good care of their children. Child Fund worked with the community to establish a preschool to help children with the transition to primary school. The advantages of a child going through a preschool are as follows. One, that a child is friendly with the school environment. Two, a child will learn how to share things with their friends. They also have the basic skills of writing. They'll be very free in class. My children benefited from Child Fund Preschool in many ways. They learnt a lot of things at preschool. They were able to express themselves when they went for grade one. Now they're in grade one and they're performing very well. Healthy, confident children like the Masumos have a great platform to start their formal education. Child Fund believes the middle life stage 6 to 14 is also an important stepping stone to enabling children to become responsible adults in the future. We work with uh, children, we get them involved through uh, child-friendly school programs where we aim at setting up a good, and, uh, good learning environment for children. Child Fund is also working with children, young people and their communities in the remote mountainous area around Juhuetla in Pueblo, Mexico. Young people have been facilitating younger children in a range of activities. They've also been taking part in a project to identify the needs of their community. Well, I'm part of the project called Youth as Communicators. Its main objective is to do research in the community to find evidence of things that are happening that we don't like. What is missing is we don't have roads with pavements. We don't have enough doctors and we don't have enough access to the internet. In order to make our dreams a reality, we need financial resources and also support from the people of the community. What I can do is get them to express themselves and ensure that they do not remain silent. What I feel most proud of is I'm participating as a leader in this process of change and it is a way of getting people informed and aware of the main issues within their communities in order to do things to improve the community. What I like to tell other young people, like me, is that they should join organisations like Child Fund because it is a place where children and young people have the freedom to express themselves and act.